Hi, Kelvin. You know what time it is? What's up? Uh, <laughs> we are going on an air conditioning service call around the right. corner from here. And the customer's complaint is the AC is not blowing air. I hate those. Yeah. Because that means we usually have to go into an attic. Yep. So we'll try to get some footage while we're there. Maybe you can uh, redeem yourself. <laughs> can you be? Are you redeemable? Yes, man. You are. Okay. We'll see, Kelvin. Stay tuned, guys. So we're working on this central air system, R22 based. Um, we're questioning the filter whether that's actually clean or not. It's hard to tell with this filter, but uh, I think it's dirty. Uh, but the system's got some ice buildup on it. As you can see there, nothing terrible yet. But right now I got the, the thermostat, the cool set to off, fan set to on, and we do have airflow coming out of the vents. It feels kind of okay for the system. I put my hand up to the diffuser in one of the bedrooms and I, it feels like good airflow. So uh, it may just be a case of um, dirty filter or hopefully not, maybe slightly undercharge of refrigerant R22. Kelvin has got the Testo 557. He's hooking up the high side hose to the liquid line surface port. And now he's hooking up the low side hose to the suction side service port. And I'm pretty sure the pressures are not gonna be equal, but we'll see. They actually are equal. Normally when you have a frozen coil, they, uh, they won't be balanced. In this case it is. So we have a uh, we have a definitely a severely undercharged system. You know the this temperature should equal outdoor and or indoor ambient temperature, and it's not 46.4 degrees at right now. That's for sure. So Kelvin, what's the verdict? Well, they're undercharged severely, so we got to charge them up. But uh, it's an old system. Probably a leak somewhere. And, um. The, the evaporator's blowing, so, uh. What'd you say? The evaporator's blowing, so it can't the be. The evaporator's blowing? Like the, the blower motor. The blower's blowing, so. So, what's your diagnosis, Kelvin? You have to charge the system. The diagnosis is we need to charge the system. Yes? Yes. The diagnosis of the system is undercharged. <laughs> oh, we have, oh, yeah. yeah the solution is the, the solution system needs to, to be charge charged up. Um, and if it was a newer system, you know, we would have, you know, discuss, you know, leak search and things like that. But I'm just going to say, listen, let's put some refrigerant into the system. Let's see what size this bad boy is. It's a three ton. You can tell by that 36 right there. GSC 18036, so three ton R22 system, came factory charged with 119 ounces, you can see right there. We're like, yeah, and this is, not that much ice on anything. And like I said, we have airflow. And the compressor, listen, this thing's been running for a while, the compressor would be an iceberg, but it's not. So, definitely no recent maintenance on this bad boy. You see tons of leaves inside there. Another R22 system. So there we have it. We're gonna recommend, because of the age, you know, first, you know, replace the equipment. Number two, uh, add refrigerant. If you're gonna add refrigerant, you know, on an older system, might as well just add some dye to it with a super with a sealant. So we'll see what the homeowner wants to do.